Welcome back to One Night in Roxburgh, Ink and Dust. I guess. This sounds like Earth. This is music. Hmm. Ice, I guess. Fire, obviously. Darkness. Water. This is air. And the vine. Okay. Well, I'm not yet ready to do any of this, I think. Where are we? This is kind of like the eastern end of the place, I guess. Remember the keys, it actually has a sign, right? Uh, the boiler him? I guess I have books of all sorts, including mechanist books. Oh yeah, let's not have the lights and things. Oh, this is the rest of the... That was the last one I went to with the bed. Okay. Pile of books. You guys really need more gold stuff, you know? Well, I mean, you need more gold stuff so that you can then have less gold stuff, right? So I can come and take it all. Water arrow is appreciated. It'll make up the one that I wasted. I haven't really used them any yet, but I'm kind of thinking about saving most of them for uh, barracks excrement. It's a random thing to find around, but I kind of understand what it might be useful for now. Why is this room all flooded? Let's check that in a minute. Wait, is this just. Oh, that's just where it came from. Okay. Just the room that was a block of ice before. Still many places here I haven't been to. So it's just a concern. Let's try and not disturb anyone who's asleep. Bathrooms. Right, I didn't go upstairs. I assume there's still people up here. Oh no, I came from here. Right, I wanted to come back to the legends room. Because... Oh no, I've been here, right? I did this already. I wanted to check if this statue had gem eyes. No, that's one of the statues that will be a living statue. Okay, so this is where it came from. I haven't found my way there yet, right? I guess it's these stairs I have not been down. Damn an elevator. 
So better than this taking the stairs. Safer than taking the stairs. Probably neither, right? Probably not safer. One of those things. Knowledge is our purpose, our faith. No, I'm not going to be able to do anything here without giving out all the torches. Do they have anything I need? They do have money. Let's try. Nothing else I need to do, right? Damn. Yes, there it is. There it is. Just make sure he turns around again. Well, there you go, right? Spending two water arrows to get past, that absolutely makes sense, right? Somebody dropped a book at the bottom of the elevator shaft. It's worth money. <laughs> the elevator shaft goes down to stairs up and down. What is this place? We've got more... This is a soul Kimo. Hmm, right, these are the... not the novice quarters, these are the... Slightly higher ranking souls. Soul 12. Standing here, well lit, in a lot while uh, that fellow was wandering around, but. Oh, you guys have odd taste in interior decoration, don't you? Instructions about the Dark Zone. Here are the procedures to follow for the Dark Zone. Interpreted Tarsal has exclusive authority in the zone. No soul is authorized to access it without his approval. Any deviation from this rule will result in severe punishment. Every incident must be reported to the interpreters and to the superior soul. The access to the zone must be locked at all times. One soul will be assigned to guard the access. For the present, soul Kimal has been chosen. Please respect him and help him if required. The opening of the zone follows a strict protocol. Firstly, soul Kimal opens the security cage with the lever located in the meter's room. Secondly, Interpreter Tarsal uses his key to open the control panel of the second cage. Interpreter Tarsal is the only one authorized to use that key. Thirdly, use the key of darkness specific to the dark zone to open the access. The opening can only be done with Interpreter Tarsal's approval and the soul in charge of the access. Alright, so we're going to need Interpreter Tarsal's key. We're going to need the lever we need to find the meter's room. Alright, so this is dark zone access from here. I guess. Hello? So 
Attends, moi, je vais là. Arrive au poc. Oh, is each of these. Is each of these rooms? That's the meter's room. She needs a key. It's about the 25th locked door I've encountered tonight. That needs a key. Somebody nearby, but I'm not sure who. Yep, more stairs. So dirted. I'm sorry I dirted your clothes by dropping you on the floor. Well, the stairs are good for something. Make a good body storage point. <sighs> Workshop Street Bellowing Machine and Foundry. Oh, right, I don't know where anyway, we are now. We're below the hallway that was collapsing. With the... Statue? Half in the wall. people around and I don't know where they are. Well now I know where they are. We're one of them. I didn't even flash him, but... This room, right? Maybe it connects. Oh, maybe this is the same room? I don't know, but since you guys are all basically no topples. basically highly on edge and attack me immediately I think prudence still says I'll make better progress okay I toppled the topples uh, prudence still says I'll make better progress by knocking everybody out than by trying to be too too stealthy here but sure and I can't hear what's going on though One of you claims to have found a hidden passage inside the foundry when he was arranging some tools into a few crates. Dainty let me know its location as soon as possible. So came out. Tools in crates, huh? Hidden passage. Gas bomb. Flask of distilled water. Some storage here. What do we got? Maintenance freezing. Not sure what that is. Gas arrow. 
mine, a flash mine, phosphorus and product. Moss and water arrows, good, good. Is it a walkway above me or just a shell? I don't know, because, like, because people can hear me in here, because uh, I don't know what's up with the room brushing. I don't want to jump and look on top of the shelves, because uh, they would hear me land on the floor. I suppose I could burn a moss arrow. Wait, or is that not a noisy floor? Oh, that's a quiet floor, okay. I just thought it was a continuation of the same metal, but nope. I'm going to save the carpets for this room. Alright, it doesn't look like there's anything else in here. That's the metal. What is it? Secret passage, tools and crates. Should make a note of that. I can't, I don't have a notes page either. That is a walkway up here. Fascinating, using the knowledge of the mechanists for our missions. Those religious fanatics have opened for us a great field of possibilities for our expeditions. We need to improve that knowledge by upgrading their machines, for Sol Reticle's accident shows their weaknesses. I don't understand why we couldn't design these machines ourselves. Would our knowledge be so limited in that domain? Or was Karras really the builder's chosen one? Sol Dirty. Oof, less of darkness, but it doesn't really help me. Yeah, right, this is the walkway above the storage. I think that's the guy down low down that attacked me before. Let's see. Yes. <sighs> Almost happened again. Not a book. Has my eyes. That's kind of like molten metal or molten rock or something. It's not the book. The glyph has definitely done weird things to your eyes, mate. There's a bunch of crates there. Sulfur rod. Although, if this was the area with the secret passage. There's more places I could go in this upper walkway. Notice, following the recent incidents in the city of Roxburgh, the expeditions are cancelled until the situation has returned to normal. Consequently, workshop activity is reduced by 85%. However, since they are still running, ensure that the manufacturing machines are used occasionally so they maintain the correct settings. Interpreter Tessa. Now, let's turn down this light.
this the billowing machine? Is if I need a billowing machine? Seems like a bad idea. Okay, so what the hell? Yeah. Wow, it's safe all the way back here. Is there anything else up here beyond that note? Don't think so, right? Yeah, that was not important. All right. Is this the way I've been? Oh, this is the way I came. Right, well... I'm not going to get past those two. Especially not when one of them is not killable. <laughs> the one that needed to be killed. Doesn't seem knockoutable either. Storage? Wait, you've got a locked storage room with nothing in it. Oh, that's super helpful, guys. Super helpful. I wonder if this book should be considered as dangerous. I feel concerned by its words. Although your key will be appreciated. So I'll need that when I try and get into the dark side. This is the billowing machine. Foundry. Which I can't use. Here's more tools and crates. Guess I do need to look for a uh, That's the key for that. Oh, this is the, me the, the mechanicals room. Right. So if we go to Sol Kimmel's room here. It's not nice and dark in here now. You can come out of the corridor almost as well. Then, but this is still shut. Hmm. Well, I don't need to go into the dark zone yet, right? I should do the light zone first. 
We should keep on exploring this place. That's where I came from. Oh, I have explored this place. But how do I get to the light zone? It's not from the workshop, is the answer. Maybe up these stairs. I didn't find the secret passage in the workshop, you know what? That's maybe a problem. Oh, this is where they had the meeting, I think. Protective soul intercept. I heard some fast moving footsteps and I'm wondering if I got seen or if the body got seen. Seems not. Is that just where I came in? A lot of salamander, okay. If I had somebody labelled that, I wouldn't have been able to tell I'm not that. Not what it's all about. Mystical animal blood types. I could have turned the lights off too. Wait, these are not the stairs I came in. Are they? Oh, yes they are. You can join whoever it is here. Okay, putting tools in crates. Wasn't happening in this room. Let's see if we can find the secret passage. Not there. It's the meter's room. Oh, this lever? No, that lever doesn't work. Okay. We'll worry about dark zone access later. We've got the instructions. I didn't go up here, did I? Is this still going to the workshop or is this going connected to somewhere else? Shit. Well... best place for you. Honestly, that was a little low. What happened here? Oh. Maybe there used to be two statues? I'm not sure where that thing was and how I should have avoided it. Because they always seem to stand still rather than move about. God, I have no idea where I am now. Can't be knocked out, can you? Well, this takes me out of the workshop anyway. To somewhere else. I'm hoping to find the secret passage in the workshop. They've got one of those bellows to get past in here somehow. 
tools in crates. Crates. Noisy machine. Storeroom. But the storeroom had lots of crates, but I didn't see any sign of a secret passage. I mean. If there was one, this would be a good place to hide one, right? We're going to see some tools into a few crates inside the foundry. Inside the foundry? Right, we got a label on one of the doors saying foundry, right? Is that this one? Linking workshop one eight linking machine. Right, one of them had a label saying foundry. Here we are, filling machine foundry. Aha. Aha. Here we go. More tunnels. Where does this take us? How do we get out? Maybe a switch on this side? Am I just not seeing it because I'm blind? Or because it's very dark, or both? Hello? Who's been through here murderously? He killed one of the weird small creatures, that's not good. Ah. Whose quarters are these? Well, they won't be needing their candlesticks anymore, that's for sure. It calls me. The zone. No, it's beings, it's livings, it's dead. No. This door. Curse be it. I do not understand it. Origin. Purpose. Source. Why well, lose my time, right? Dark. Blind. Glyph book. A.H. Telestrator. Is this Superior Soul Huso? Seeing that Talus is a traitor. Talus of the Dark Zone is a traitor? Really? What the? Dark Grenade. Message number six of six. It is here that our evening ends. Yeah. Enjoy the music. In terms of the task cells key. And tomorrow, when thou dost return home, Good your up, servant will be waiting for thee. Yes, they travel on their own. Indeed, on occasion, they will leave your homes in response to a device I call the Guiding Beacon. They return to us for but small adjustments. Upon their return to your home, ah. better servants than we. I apologize yet again for my absence tonight, noble friends. Fare thee well. Thanks, Karis. I hope I fare well as well. So that's the other side of those people I couldn't get past. That also answers that question of what's in the rest of this workshop area. Cool. Okay. So, um... And so for the Tassel, has exclusive authority in the zone. 
So Kimmel opens the security cage with the lever located in the meter's room. That didn't seem to work. I'm gonna push that lever and the security case didn't open, but that's where the key would go. Well, alright, I don't need to worry about that yet. I wanna go find the stairs. Take these stairs up again. Where our nice friend is hanging out on the railings. Uh, no, not these stairs. Wait, maybe these stairs? No, that's that's the lower library places. More stairs. Wait, I'm confused. Where were those other stairs I was going up and down before? Some meters room. This way. Why was storage too completely empty? Is there anything up here that I should be picking out? I mean, there's a climbable ladder. Doesn't look like it though. Board, cheesy machine, ceiling machine, climbing's room. up here, was it? Where'd it go? I don't remember at all where I, where I was, just a while back. Do you remember I kind of left the workshop? is still stuck up there, so we'll have to remain so, I think. Sorry, dude. Are you the one I heard running about up here? Suddenly very loud. Soul Duma. Uh -huh. Oh, there's my friend on the uh, staircase. More maps. 
Another passage. Hello, what's up here? <laughs> Old candlestick. Take that. Yeah, you scared me. Stands here. The origins of Roxburgh. According to the scriptures, at the origins of our time, these lands were no more than dust and stone. Until one event disrupted its very nature and allowed the men to conquer the lands. From our estimations in the year 980, before the foundation of the old city, a great cataclysm began. In the year 970, it provoked the destruction of Karastin and indirectly took part as a precursor's fall in the year 300. It is proven that the epicenter of this disaster is the place where the city of Roxburgh has been raised. A stone from the infinite, the star, fell from the skies and landed in what used to be a desert. The collision awoke the anger of the grounds and created the Great Cataclysm. It is highly probable that the impact area is in fact the Great Lake nearby the city. For reasons we do not understand, after many centuries of chaos had passed, the star transformed the desert of ancient times into fertile lands. A gigantic forest emerged from the ground. Life became stronger than nature could have ever conceived. Therefore, primitive man found all the necessary conditions for his survival. Thus, during the Dark Age, the community of Roxburgh was born. As time went by, it grew to become the fortress we all know today. Even the name of the city, Roxburgh, suggests its chaotic origins. The city of the rock, the town which covered the stone from the skies. No one knows who chose such a name, but strong doubts remain about the trickster's influence on the founders. How ironic that would be, a hammeric bastion suggested by the Lord of the Woods. As time goes by, memories of the catastrophe began to emerge, different kinds of earthquakes, the breath of the stone. One of these tremors reached the old city once, during the Second Golden Age, and aroused the curiosity of men of the secret. As they found out the whereabouts of these tremors, some of these men faced an impossible truth. Thus, the Order was born. Superior Sol Huso. Needing a drink there. You won't be needing a nice painting either. Nine paintings are found. Oh, what were you reading over here? The Book of the Names. Oh shit, I need that. <laughs> well, I think I just threw it down the stairs. Okay. I was trying to read it, I was like, pick it up, put it right click to you, read it. Nope. Oh, what's this? That's valuable, apparently. Boring to read, but, you know, should fetch a good price. Okay. Um. I'll get the book of the names in a minute, I've got a secret passage to check out first. This might be the same one I've been to. Four, or might be an entirely new one. It looks new to me. Ah, it probably joins up with the old one. Yeah, okay. How do you get up here? I mean, you get, I guess it's a way down. I mean, I think you could actually kind of stick a rope arrow in here and have a rope. That's maybe climbable. <clears throat> yeah, it's not climbable. With a better angle, you could do it. But... Okay, let's go find that book again that we need. Hello, what's that up there? Candle or something, I guess. Not something I can pick up, okay. Oops. You know what, Duma? My choice in flooring is regrettable, but, um, 
still make it seem like you are <laughs> asleep. I mean, everybody else is kind of gonna wake up in an, in an awkward cuddle pile somewhere, but uh, you're superior. You get to sleep alone. A high and lonely destiny or something. I'm just gone. What? Oh no, where did they go? Sounds like they're going up and down the stairs. Yes. That's not great for me. I guess I better see where this goes. This looks familiar. This is where we came in right at the start. It is too. Will superior souls be up in this stuff? Wait. Interpret the South key. South star key won't work. Nope. There's still more doors I can't open. I don't understand why. Where is the entrance to the light turn? Right, this is where I came in. Did I try this door? I mean, I have a couple of keys. They're not going to work, right? I have no reason to suspect it will work. Right, I don't really know where I'm going. Although I don't need to go that way. So that's, the, that's the legends room. So lost. It's one of the secret doors. It's another locked door. That's like four of them, I think. Not in a label. It's like okay, there's lots of locked doors, but. Do I open them? Where are they? Where do they go? <laughs> Alright, well I haven't been through here yet, have I? It's another transition sign. This isn't going to get me where I need to be, is it? Dangerous, he said. It's definitely a narrow path. Soul sick? What? What are you doing here? I mean, should I be taking you back to the place? Should I not be taking you somewhere? Is this a bad idea? Did you die in here? Where is this transition go zone going to and from? Oh, 
Oh, this is a... Oh, I see. This is the guy who let me access to the North Star, right? Is he gonna complain if I if he sees me carrying this guy? Do you need soul sick? I mean, are you feeling soul sick? I, I don't know. Whatever. I don't remember if that was open before. That was the one I went through. Okay, so that just also leads to the North Star, just slightly more drama than the other one. the room of the keys. Okay, well I guess I need to try to make some keys. Where's the instructions? Dark zone. Here we are. What permits the creation of light on the left? What allows interpretation of light on the right? An eye allows the interpretation of light, right? What permits the creation of light? I can't put my land in there, but that would seem to fit. <laughs> Flash bomb. Flare. Interpretation of lights. An eye. No. Please give me the key. No. Maybe it's not a flare. Fluorescent. Aha. Light key. Okay. What do we got here? Where's the instructions again? Somewhere here. Just this one that's that's tinkering. Oh, this isn't tinkering, this is Earth. Infinite of the Earth on the left belong to an organism living with the Earth on the right. The infinite of the Earth. Sand from the burnt lands? Sand? It's like more or less infinite sound, right? It belongs to a creature living with the earth. I mean, yes, earth key, okay. Good, this will this'll clear up some of my inventory as well. What's next? What's after earth? Ice. Represents the infinite of the ice and permits the creation of ice. Alright, that's key. We don't actually need all these keys, I don't think. But uh, it will clean up my inventory, so that's good.
what remains of the fire on the left and what belongs to an organism living with it on the right. Well, that'll be the blood of the salamander. What remains of the fire on the left? Clams oil? No. Surely not. Maybe I don't have what it needs. I mean, I can try the plastic clams oil, but it feels like. Uh, Bad idea. <laughs> That's what Bram's oil does. Okay, so fire key is still missing a thing. What represents the use of water on the left? Wait, we're not up to water. That's darkness. Water. What represents the use of water on the left and belongs to an organism living in the water on the right? this as well. Yeah, okay. Unless you're saying the salamander is not the creature in the fire, but the creature in the water. Well, I can't pick it up again, so it must be right. Okay. Air yeah, key. We'll do darkness last. What remains of the use of air on the left, and what belongs to an organism living in the air on the right? So I think we found these back in the south star. Here, it's an elemental's breath, right? Yep, that's the air key. Vine. Infinite of the vine and mankind's madness. Ah, that's mankind's madness, it's cursed seeds. What is the infinite of the vine then? Maybe I don't have it. Surely not the rotten fruit. An apple. No. You know what, let's eat some. Oh yeah, I'll go hit point back. Okay, let's get back to darkness. So vine, we're missing something. Water, we're missing something. Fire, we're missing something. The dark zone. Mankind's madness on the left. Wickedness of darkness. On the right. You know what, let's keep that. Mankind's madness. Wickedness of darkness, that seems to be rotten flesh. Oh, the Magnus Mask was indeed the Mankind's Madness. Okay. We should have one water thing, one vine thing, and one fire thing left to find. Well, if I find. Any objects that seem unexplained? I don't have anything else that seems unexplained, do I? Everything else I think I can use? Yeah. Okay. 
Now what? I don't even remember where where to go. Oh, I don't know where to go for the light zone, right? Unless the light, the light zone, unless the light zone is accessible from the South Star. No, I thought it'd been there right in the South Star. I don't know. Regardless, um, I think it's a pretty good place to end the episode. But thanks for watching, and uh, I'll see you here for the next one.